And what does the meat get now? This is beef, right? It's beef because, as you know, in the Jewish dietary laws, you would not eat pork. Pork is not forbidden. Okay. Uh, it's forbidden, rather. Um, we use in sausage meat beef. Okay. Out of the casing. Is it flavored with something or no? Right now, just not yet. Nothing. Okay. But uh, what, what does happen in this dish, which is very simple to do, it's blended with fettuccine or tagliatelle. All right. Which More already, tagliatelle that we have in the. In we've the already pot. got started here okay. a little bit. Okay. Good. I'm that looks using good. a dry pasta. All right. And uh, this gets to be cooked, and uh, some of the liquid. Mm -hmm. It's important to use as the ultimate sauce for the tagliatelle, tagliatelle. frisin sal or amin. Why frisin sal? Frisin sal because this dish, by the way, has a three or four different names. Amin is one. Amin is one. Yeah. Frisin sal in Venice means fried in salt, mm -hmm. and it has no connection to salt at all. At all. Then yeah. there is another one called the rota di faraone, the wheel of the pharaohs. Oh. And it doesn't mean anything. anything to, okay. No. But it's very important to know so that historically. All right. So we need to transfer it? Right. Okay. If you could want just to put it in a bowl? Yes. This you want goes to put into in a, bowl? a bowl right okay. there. Okay. So the meat goes into a bowl. All right. And that was how much? This is what? A pound? A couple of pounds. Couple of pounds. Yes. Okay. What you do, you're going to add some toasted pine nuts, which I have right here. All right. Toasted pine nuts. Right. All right. They go in. Could you use something else besides pine nuts? Or I wouldn't. It is this emblematic. Is, this is traditional. Certainly. Okay. Emblematic of uh, Jewish uh, Italian dieting, or I should say the Sephardic world. Uh, I mean, the Jews in Spain, Portugal, mm -hmm. Italy, and France especially, to use pine nuts and raisins in many of the applications. Okay. And the raisins go in. All right. right. So pine nuts and raisins, kind of like an agro dolce. Agro dolce, but taste. without the. There is no acid just yet. Okay. You do salt. Un po' di sale. I don't have to teach yeah. you. No, no, no. I do salt, no, no. Do salt uh, a piacere. A piacere. Okay. And a little pepper. Brava. All right. And I'm going to do le fettuccine. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Which I'm going to put it right that. in there. And so we mix it in the bowl, but now this goes back in the pan or this ready no, to no, eat? No, no. This is ready to be served. This is it. So, so you were saying there's something First mandatory? First and foremost, in a dish such as this, uh, the juice of Ferrara will prepare them on a Friday. On a Friday? Because you can eat it as it is now, hot, uh -huh. or you can eat it cold or room temperature. And That's what they would do, they will use mm. either goose fat mm -hmm. as a fat or olive oil. Mm -hmm. Or typically schmaltz would have been, which schmaltz could be by uh, rendering chicken fat mm. to give it additional flavor. Smells delicious. Now do you we're going to do a little olive a oil. A little olive oil over the top. Over the top, so that this makes all the ingredients that are here mm. can be room temperature without so, any worries. Almost as if you're serving a salad, right? That's right. Well, it's beautiful. Okay, and that was called amin. Amin or frisin salt. 